How's it going, everybody? And welcome back to another new episode of Let's Play Chrono Trigger. Last episode, we found the rainbow shell. T Terrorists! Who? What? Terrorists? Um, we kind of forgot about something. Methinks it's a uh, good time, kind of, for the original three to come in. Princess Nadia! I've been worried, Princess. I understand your pain, but the king really only cares about his realm. Yes, even when your mother, Queen Eliza, passed away, he worked all day. No one could do that. It's inhuman! Oh, child. It's ancient history now. Tell me more. This may be difficult. Well, Queen Eliza's condition suddenly changed for the worst. She desperately wanted to see the king one last time, but he couldn't find the time to drop by. Said he had some work to do. But knowing nothing about death, he waited faithfully by your mother's side. Eliza passed away in sorrow. It's as if the king indirectly killed her. Such a shame. What? My father killed? My mother? What do I know? There are reasons for everything, right, dear? Now, so glad to see you back again. Please go and visit the The king ordered that the court be locked until the trial is over. Okay. What trial? See, the kitchens haven't changed much. Can't get anything done with you standing around. Jeez, I ain't gonna poison the canceller. Cut the foolishness. Okay, something ain't right. On hyper ether. It's locked. No entry allowed. Let me throw! Had any of you heard of the rainbow shell? I too had no idea until I found this. It's an ancestral will. It says, Unveil the rainbow shell to the people at the Millennial Fair. What are you talking about? We have no family heirlooms here. So this is a forgery. Why does the defendant deny the people a glimpse of the rainbow shell? Because he no longer has it. He sold the heirloom for cash. Witness, please. What is it, Nadia? We are conducting a trial here. Father! Nadia, the Chancellor is trying to frame me. He hurls insults. Confirm your innocence with proof. Proof? Yes, if he hasn't sold the heirloom, it should be in the castle. Show me the rainbow shell, and I'll accept his innocence. <laughs> Chancellor, what kind of trickery is this? Remove them! No entry allowed! Let me throw! 
Princess, not even you may enter. Find the rainbow shell and we'll be able to prove the king's innocence. What are you saying? It's a lie. There is no heirloom. We changed history back at 600 AD, so the rainbow shell should still be in the castle. Aha! The rainbow shell we gave to my ancestor 400 years ago is still here. It's probably in the basement. Well, let's go get it. The king may not have been a friend to us, but he's still the king. Ouch! A rat bit me! The boss is itching to avenge the grudge that's been in the family for 13 generations! Yee! He's gotta frame the king! Gah! Not very likely. I see you haven't gotten stronger in 400 years. Though there is a plot! Let's hurry! I confess, I bought it from the king. He said he needed the cash. Liar! I've never even seen you before! Order in the court! Was I convincing? shell what's this a letter tomorrow dearest tomorrow I know things are tough between you and your father but nothing can break your bond of blood neither words of anger nor great distances some day when you have children you will understand the special bond is part of a family tree which links us together. Queen Gaudia the twenty first, lean. Boy, can she tell it like it is. Father, hang in there, we're coming. You got one prism shard. Members of the jury. If he is guilty, stand to the left. If innocent, stand to the right. Guilty. You ain't getting in our way this time. Princess, not even you may enter. You won't reconsider. No, Princess. There is one way. It's a bit rough, but just follow me. 
the verdict is in. Guilty! The guardian line ends here. This domain shall be mine. Take him away. Wait! Who is it? Father! Nadia! Princess, control yourself! You're too late! The king has been found guilty! Even kings are subject to our laws! No, this was a setup! Nonsense! The king's a crook! But the treasure is right here! Impossible! Your little scheme is over, Chancellor. Uh, I'm, I mean, uh, huh? <laughs> it's not the plot you think. I am here to avenge my ancestors. Super Ultra Presto Transformo! Yakura the 13th. What the hell? Let's hit him with a Luminaire Bomb. is our fire sword too. That was even 
worse. Um. Frick. Please keep getting some damage and throw a mega bomb at him. Oh, don't confuse her, please. Frick. I apparently can't target. Change of plans, or a world. Okay, all of a sudden this went from us kicking butt to us getting our butts kicked. Spin version 13. Parasaur 2. Please don't be hitting Moro again. Chrono this time. Thank God he can take it. I didn't even think about how you felt. Um, I know it in my heart, but the words just come out wrong. I too have that problem. I thought you left me, but realized that it was I who abandoned you. But I'm here now. We'll talk about everything that's happened. About Chrono, and Mother, and your mother, how sad. It has taken me so long to understand what Eliza meant with her last words. Someday, when Nadia grows up, she will bring her beloved to meet you. Welcome him. It will be a day you remember forever. You heard her last words? Of course. You were so young. You ran around saying, Daddy, it's fun having all my favorite people here. Seeing you so happy, she felt reassured, and she left us quite peacefully. So that's how it was. 
Yes, why? I used to call you daddy. You did. I'm sorry, daddy. I'm really sorry for doubting you. I'll let you exit the castle, but you be careful now. Take care of her. Yes, sir! It's my turn now. Melchior! Can't let you run the whole show. Let me make some weapons from the rainbow shell. Finally time for me to do something. Watch and learn! We have a couple things to do before we leave the castle. First things first, it sure looked like Yakra dropped something. Wow, they fixed the glass fast, didn't they? You got one Yakra key. Finally! That beast keeping me locked up in here! Princess Nadia! Your friends, I presume? Wait! I don't have time for this! I must prepare for the Moonlight Parade! I guess it's the same in all ages. This is a very rare. It is armor, it deflects magic. I can make you one prism dress, featuring maximum defense. Or I can make three less effective prism helms. Which would you prefer? Um, let's go for the prism dress. The prism dress? Only females may equip it. Alright, you just wait there. Finished! Off you go now! Interesting substance. I can make some great stuff with an alloy of it. Huh. An alloy, huh? I wonder what we could potentially mix with it. That's a boost. Time to leave the castle. Sorry, fellas. I'm terribly embarrassed. Take care of Princess Nadia, okay? The real Chancellor's okay. He took off to the knight's room saying he was getting ready for the parade. The soldiers hired by the fake Chancellor were all monsters. Now this is what I call a 1,000th anniversary. The king's finally feeling better. No one could tell that the chancellor was a beast. The soldiers hired by the fake chancellor were all monsters. Okay, that was the way to the prison. Princess Nadia, at the Prune Night Parade, you will receive a lovely present from me. Now we can go on with the Moonlight Parade. 
The parade's the grand finale. I'm Pierre, the lawyer. I've been planning the Millennial Parade with the Chancellor. Gonna be a great night. It's the kind of parade that brings out the kid in all of us. Well, let's go swing by the inn. And I think we'll go check in with, uh... Taban, and we'll check in with, uh, Rona's mom. Are you buying? Sure. Thanks. I'll play you a song. Into the fair yet? Yep. Wasn't that a trip? I spent all my silver points at the Tent of Horrors. Creepy that she's playing the music from the future. Let's go see Taban. Oh, you're just in time. You got one tavern suit. Got one tavern help. More of her. I've been making items she'd like. The helm's not much of an imp- Oh, yeah, it is an upgrade, but the sidecaps are better. Wow, she still had an iron helm equipped. Oops. You know what, I betcha. Is that her best weapon? Yeah, at least that's it. Luca and Taban only care about their silly toys. Well, I think we have some new friends to introduce to Chrono's mom. Start. Let's do that really quick. I don't believe she's met Isla or Frog. Dear me, Chrono, how many times have I told you to keep your pets outside? Madame. I am not a pet. Though I am odd of figure, I am a master swordsman. It talks! Er, I just thought I mean I'm terribly sorry, uh, Mr. Toad. No, my name is Yes dear? Toad will do for now. Gracious, who are you? Me Isla. Isla, a young lady doesn't dress like that, my dear. But Isla like... Yeah, yes, ma'am. Chrono strong. Chrono mother strong, too. <laughs> Are you one of Chrono's friends? Another quiet one. Don't be shy, dear. Well, I think it's about time to wrap this episode up. As always, I hope you've enjoyed it. Next episode, we will fly out, and uh, let's see what we can find of this alloy that can be made with the rainbow ship. As always, thanks for watching. Please like, subscribe, and favorite. Throw any feedback you may have in the comments below. And I'll talk to you again next time on another new episode of Let's Play Chrono Trigger. Farewell.